Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Unfortunately, not so great news today. If you're watching this video, that means that you are trying to find a solution how to verify your account. So, as you can see in my background, this is the message that uh, NCSOFTS have sent and announced. It already happened. After the temporary maintenance on January 8th, we would like to inform you about the device registration security service that you must sign up for when accessing Tron and Liberty. To play Tron and Liberty, you must subscribe to the full server security service. What this means is that if you are in majority of the people that are uh, not ignoring the elephant in the room, meaning that you have purchased an account, you will definitely have this problem. So, it will request an SMS verification when you are trying to attach the device pretty much your computer. And if you don't have access to that phone, you'll need to instantly contact your seller. Try to do that uh, a bit earlier because there is a specific amount of resending for verification that can be done and if you spam this you might need to wait for three up to even four hours until you can do this again now for the guys that purchased an account that does not offer such services from their sellers you are pretty much out of your account unless you purchased an account that did not have a phone attached with the account in that case scenario, you don't even need a seller. You can just attach a phone number. And I'm talking about any number from any country. Meaning you can be in USA, England, Norway, doesn't matter. I'm from Montenegro and it worked out for me. So it will work for you as well. Unfortunately, for me, worked on the new account. But we'll get to that. So, like I said, most of the guys uh, have this issue and if you're lucky you will solve it meaning that if you're lucky that there was no uh, phone number attached or that the seller offers such service you are the lucky one but we need to understand that most of the phone numbers that these sellers used or it's been done by reseller meaning that though they have, they don't have an access to the original phone number or it was just temporary phone numbers that they use during the registration, which means that they don't uh, have this phone in permanent use. So you practically lost your account and you need to deal with it. Now, I don't want to be like rude or anything, but I need to remind people in each of my videos where I was talking about how to play in Korean region, Throne in Liberty or whatever game that you wanted to play in Korean region, you needed to understand and accept the fact that you might lose an account because even now, if you would get an account and you change on it, and this is, I'll, I'll get to it, this as well, and you change the full credentials, excluding the ID because you can't, you're not a Korean citizen, you can't really have that, and it's freaking illegal. I mean, the whole process of having an account that's not by your name is illegal, but like I said, it's an elephant in the room that pretty much everybody is ignoring, including the NC software. Are they ignoring it? Because now we are without accounts, most of us. Um, so what I'm now trying to explain to the people and what I said earlier is do not get attached to the account. Do not get attached to the character. This is temporary. If you want to test the game, try out the game. So. If you already seen what you wanted to see from the game and you have some kind of idea of what to expect once the worldwide release comes, that's pretty much it. Now, I will shift my uh, subject quickly to the account. Purchases, meaning if you try to purchase an account now, make sure that you don't do what I did and quite a, a lot of us, we expected the Throne and Liberty release for Worldwide will be kinda sooner. But as you can see, Amazon isn't doing any advertisement, uh, marketing, there's no stress beta test announced uh, for different regions, nothing is happening. And that's about it. So for sure, 
we are looking for between three to six months as i mentioned in the previous video the original date was february that we hoped for because the game was released in december and we were counting three to six months to worldwide release but it's not happening because of the marketing as i mentioned so if you want to wait until worldwide release and not play that's your choice if you want to learn more about the game by playing the game you need to buy an account of course don't be too much worried about uh, reaching where you were before because they did uh, quite a few updates it's quite easy to hit level 50 you need less than a day if you put a lot of effort into it but if you play casually it's two days three days if, if you like uh, play uh, with uh, using a main story quest and couple of side ones and contracts are giving quests i mean contracts are giving xp so you are fine you're fine you're gonna catch up quite fast now if you don't want to do that i'm suggesting you to subscribe to my channel and to all the other guys that are doing content that are trying to uh, get um, a better image of uh, what you're supposed to do once the worldwide release reaches now for the guys this is for the guys that will buy an account and have a fresh start just a reminder i'm having a fresh start at kazar i'll be playing with the pirates and uh, what i'm trying to say is if you find a seller and make sure that he can change instantly phone number for you that you offer such service that it changes the phone number and then you change as well the email and add otp as well once you already did that because you can and now you need to understand that you don't need to have a korean number for this because you're not originally registering an account you're just updating credentials on it so you can put number from any country from norway from denmark from usa doesn't matter i'm from like i mentioned from montenegro and i put the number from my country and i'm still getting nc soft verification code sent to my phone so that's not an issue that's not a problem you can also use lago fast or you can do use exit lag you're fine with both of that now like i said you also again need to be aware of it that we don't know they might end up asking for an id verification at some point so again it's temporary i don't think it's gonna happen anytime soon but if it does happen be warned i said it and a lot of people mentioned it as well if you're not in that five percent of the players that have korean friends or having somebody doing this favor to you you are never 100 percent guaranteed that your account not end up being lost because of some additional verification in the future so if you are past this make sure that you do what i suggested make sure that your seller is a person that is offering such service to update uh credentials and phone number on your account on the account that you purchase so kazar server probably starting tomorrow fresh start uh, i'll make sure that there's a lot of content uh, that will make stuff easier for you guys and i'm looking forward having much more pvp content as i'm a person that prefers pvp over pv but i must admit throne and liberty has quite the amount of the dungeons and it's quite interesting i hope you like this video don't get mad on me i was just honest and uh subscribe like and share See you in the next video.